Hi, I'm Eugenio Paguntalan and today I'll show you how to use C# -sharp HTML encode method. So what it what is HTML encode? What it does is it converts all the characters that are not allowed in HTML. For example, um if the user type uh, a paragraph tags or or font tags or marquee tags inside the text box, the system will just display um will just display it as an ordinary tag so it won't uh, it won't execute the command so to show you how it works let's do the codes so first let's add a validate request attribute here and set to false to avoid the bugs and then add a http runtime request validation mode and set to 2.0 if you are using a .NET 4.0. Okay, so as you can see in my ASPX, I I already included text box here, button with on click event and label for the result. Okay, let's go to .cs. Um, first um, first let's just. Let's just not use an HTML encode to see what would be the result. Okay? So let's just use a simple display here and then run. <clears throat> okay, let's insert a font tag here with color red. Hello. Close it. So as you can see, um, the user has a power to change dynamically the font color, which is not or, or which is potentially dangerous if the values inside the text box would directly stored in the database. Um, so uh, this is not advisable if you are not if you are about to deploy your website. Okay, so let's use the HTTP utility HTML encode and then type the text box one that text. So as simple as that. Okay, let let. Let's close this and run. Run again. Actually, Facebook has this type of technology. If you want, you can try it. Just post. Uh, just as, just update your status and post an HTML tag, and you'll see the result. Oh, let's just use the marquee. Hello. By default, um, if we press the go without HTML encode, the hello text will move. But since we use the HTML encode method, it will display an ordinary marquee tag here. There you go. See? So, um, I hope this short video tutorial will help you more improve your application. And again, this is Eugenio Paguntalan and thanks for watching.